what's up guys everything ios 007 here and today uh i have a video to show you guys the top 10 themes that i personally picked out for ios 9.2 through ios 9.3 for the jailbreak and i know that a lot of you guys are downloading tweaks and you're like you want to change from the old standard ios 7 through ios 9 and soon to be ios 10 same old look and you want to change some of that so first of all you're going to need to download Anemone, right here, which is the theming application uh, to download the themes, and uh, yeah, I'll get right into the themes. Alright guys, so this first theme is called A Year's for Anemone, and uh, as you guys can see, it has some really nice looking applications. Really, really nice looking in my opinion. And this is the standard mode, and there is also an alternative mode which I will show you guys real quick so these are the alternative icons and as you guys can see the the, mes the messages icon wallet icon health icon ibooks icon music phone and I'm pretty sure that's it so those are the icons that changed for, between the regular and the alternative mode and then here is the other icons I don't have that many third party apps on here but I do know that the theme does support third party apps so yeah that's yours. So this next theme is called Ace L Cap, and as you guys can see, it does have a new Respring logo. So once that respring's, I will unlock the phone and show you guys the actual theme. So yeah, let's open it up. And there you guys go. It's a Mac OS inspired theme, which personally, it's one of my favorites. Uh, I have it running on my personal device, and it themes every icon. Um, well, some of them aren't, like, actually themed, but they do get the circle. Like, Pokemon Go looks good with this. And so does Pokey Radar. So there you go. That is Ace L Cap. So this next theme is called Amory, and it's very similar to the theme that I had just showed you before. And uh, it has the very similar type style of icons, and over iTunes app and Cydia stores, it has little, like, the bag handles, and, yeah, it gets representing that as a store, and there are alternative, I alternative icons, and, um, so, yeah, I will show those to you. Alright, guys, so here are the alternative icons. As you can see, the photos icon has changed, messages, phone has changed, um... I'm pretty sure the wallet, yeah, the wallet icon changed. Pretty sure the stocks also changed. And you guys can see the rest for yourself. What has changed? Voice memos has changed. Pretty sure contacts, stuff like that. So, yeah, that is Amory. All right, guys, this next theme is called Muse 2. And this one definitely catches my eye. And this one definitely goes really well with the wallpaper. And the PP jailbreak icon actually blends in because there are a lot of blue icons. And as you guys can see, it's kind of a small, minimalistic looking sort of icon type. As you guys can see, inside of my extras folder, inside of my tweaks. Alright guys, so this next theme is called Soft for iOS 9. And once again, this is one of my personal favorites. It has very nice icon theming. There's no alternative icons or anything for this one. So, um, yeah, there is some nice sounds. Let me just get something open to type in. There's some nice typing sounds, though. Then the walk sound. Pretty cool. Alright guys, so that is soft for iOS 9. Alright guys, so this next theme is called Vixilium, Vixilium. Not really sure how to pronounce it. And as you guys can see, this thing has a lot done to it. The developers of this definitely put a lot into this. Icons, icon effects, there's like shadows under the icons. As you guys can see, everything is themed. It's really cool. Dock effects, stuff like that. Even up there. And, um... Let me see if it has any different sounds. Pretty sure this has different sounds. It's 
It's like the same sound as soft ride was nine. That's weird. Same sound as well, huh? So yeah, I'm. Don't think I ax. I don't think I disabled soft ride was nine. No, I didn't. Here, let me try that again. Sorry about that, guys. Um. So yeah. So by the way, this does have a custom respring logo, and it's the original Apple logo. That it's really small though, but that's so cool. All right, so now let's see the um. Let's really see the thing. Has custom icons for the battery, for the badges. Now let's see if it has custom sounds. Nope, same sound. What about locking? Same sound. Unlocking? That's just my Pokeball sound. So uh, yeah, that is pretty much it for Vixillium. And like I said, the developers definitely put a lot of time into this. I mean, look at the voice memos icon. Is that not amazing? Say, so, guys, anyways, whoa, I'm gonna start my phone there. That is Vix Liam or Vix Liam, Vix Liam, however you like to pronounce it. So, yeah, on to the next theme. All right, guys, this is Gliffy, and as you guys can see, sadly, the icons are not themed for the PP jailbreak and stuff like that, but everything else is. And this is a really, really cool theme. The developers definitely put a huge amount of time into this one. I mean, just look at these guys. Look at the icons. They are so cool. The clock kind of stands out to me. And I don't know what's going on with the calendar over there. But other than that, it looks really, really nice. And um, so, yeah, on to the next theme. All right, guys, so this next theme is called Jelly 3. And I actually really like this one. It's really cool. Only thing is that the icons that are not themed have square icons and it really doesn't look that good. Well, Activator doesn't because it's kind of like a folder, I guess. But look at that, guys. This is so... I mean, just look at the contacts one. That's really cool. Um, a lot of work implemented in this theme. As you can see, the city icon, too, is themed. Let's see if there's any sounds. Nope, and unlock sounds. Wow, so kind of like a a bell on that one for the unlock sound. Um, but look at the FaceTime. That's, this, these icons are really cool. This one's really growing on me, and I like this one. So yeah, on to the next theme. All right, guys, this theme is called Kiesel. I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it, and it does have a custom respring logo. So once this respring's, I will show you guys the theme. This theme is extremely cool, guys. I mean, just look at this. That's cool. And then at the top right there, you have some different stuff there. If I zoom in, it's kind of it's different, you know? It's cool. Once again, the PP jailbreak icons are not themed, nor is activator. And that kind of stinks. But yeah, guys, that is Kiesel. All right, guys. So this next theme is called Peebly, and I have no idea where in the heck the restart logo is. It's just, it's just not there. So I'm not really sure where that is. But, uh, you know, kind of strange. Um, there is custom things there. And this, this is the iPhone 5S. Now, if I went like this, this would feel like the phone is like a 6 plus or something because it makes the icons really small and I actually kind of like it and it does kind of theme the other icons I guess Pokemon actually looks pretty cool if you put the circle mask it would be pretty much exact like an exact fit for the Pokeball uh, so yeah I will show you guys circle mask alright guys I'm respringing to show you guys circle icons and by the way this is the last theme for our top 10 and the Respring logo is still not there. Don't know where it is. But, um. So, yeah. There you go. There is a circle mask. And look at that. Pokemon Go. Does that not look amazing? Pokemon Go is circular. And if you open up the app. Look at that, guys. Oh, no. It doesn't show it. What the heck? But, anyways. Pokemon Go. Look at that. That looks so cool. So, yeah. Here's the circle mask. And that is the end of this episode, guys. So if you did enjoy this video, please comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.